think ambition to me means um, having the desire to uh, progress and succeed. Um, and from my perspective, sometimes ambition is a negative word because um, people who are overly ambitious, um, in my experience, um, oftentimes are single-minded to the extent that they perhaps don't bring people along with them. So while um, ambition is a subject that I, you know, I haven't really thought much about, certainly if someone were to call me ambitious, I think I would kind of wince a bit and cringe because um, to me there are, there are negative connotations to the word that um, are perhaps purely due to my own background and my own cultural experiences, but, uh, but you know, naked ambition is, a, is something that I, I, I would frown upon. Whereas I think having, whether you call it a vision or a, a will to do better, that's something I can quite admire. I've met ambitious scientists in my career. I've, um, I've met ambitious museum directors who kind of see the, the goal of being director of the Tate or being director of the Science Museum as, as the one thing that they want to do in their lives. And they work really to achieve that. And, they're, they're, and they actually share it. Um, and again, my own pathway through the world, my own career, I haven't had an end point in view. You know, I haven't said I want to be, you know, director of the Tokyo Museum, which is where I am now. You know, if you'd have asked me when I finished my PhD 30 years ago, did I see myself directing a museum in New Zealand, the answer would be no. So where I am now, I wouldn't regard as the end of, you know, an ambitious desire to do what I do. It's just as a result of a, a set of almost random experiences in my life.